In this video we're going to be taking a look at draggable views. We're going to download and install the draggable views module. We're going to create a admin page for editing the order. We're going to set the trigger and the sorting and we're going to create a front page that implements the sorting. So the draggable views basically enables us to create a admin page with drag and drop where we could actually control the order of let's say articles and we could then implement the same order at the front end. Here we have a Drupal instance installed and we have the draggable views module and we're going to copy this bit and jump to our terminal for the Drupal instance that we just saw and we're going to change to the folder with the composer JSON and we're going to simply do a composer require Drupal draggable views. Perfect, so we downloaded the draggable views module. So let's jump back to the Drupal instance and under extend, let's go ahead and install the draggable views module. So we have the Juggable Views module installed. Let's go ahead and create a admin page. We're going to create a new tab here and we're going to maybe let's list just articles there because we have a content type article. So let's create a new view by going under structure, views and add a new view and we're going to say articles order and we're going to show content of type article and we're going to create a page articles order and the path will start with admin content and then articles order so that's good enough we're going to not use a pager because if we have more than 10 we would not be able to control the order there so we save and edit and as we see here under preview we are already seeing the articles but we actually want them as table that's much better and we're going to hit apply and the next thing we want to do is we'd like to actually add the draggable views content. There it is, content from the category draggable views. So we are adding that. And it is important to have it after the title like this. And we're going to also add, let's add operations so that we would have some edit and whatnot operations in the table. So if we now actually save, let's see if that looks okay. So this should be like this. And if we actually save, we're actually able to see here that the triggers are already there but we're not quite finished here because we would have to remove this sorting criteria altered on so I'm going to just remove it and we're going to add the draggable views wait that's perfect and it's going to be ascending let's try with that so I'm going to save here and let's lastly just check the menu and add a menu tab and say article order and we hit apply and we save and let's open the content overview page in a new tab and we're seeing here our new tab that we just created it's article order and let's go ahead and test it a bit 
So we have the test node entry at the top here. If we move it at the bottom and we save the order, it actually stays like that. So we have it correctly set up. And the next thing we want to do is we would like to actually have a front page like this one, but we would have just a front page with articles. So let's go ahead and create a new view from structure views and create a new view and let's call it article overview top articles let's say like the hottest article that we want to promote in our system and we're going to create a page and we are showing content of type article and we are not using the pager again and we're saying save and edit and here we have the articles but what we want to do is we would like to actually implement again the sorting of the draggable views and as we say draggable views weight sorting and as we have the same sorting as in the admin page we hit apply and as we save it, if we now go to the top articles page, we would see that the test article is at the top and the test node entry is at the bottom. And if we now actually go to the content page and article order, if we now put the test node entry at the top and the Tatast second and if we save the order and if we refresh this page we will see that the test node entry is at the top and the Tatas is second which is exactly the order that we saved in the back end. So if you like this video please check the links in the description. Ask if you have any questions on this topic share subscribe if you like this video hit the thumbs up and thanks for watching